okay, just pulled over the side of the road, a little coffee shop. Ah, and I've been invited to some little cookies. Ah, thank you. <laughs> ah, great. Ah, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> mm. Thank you. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, so I'm going to do a quick review of my bike that I take, my bike pack. Mm. <laughs> okay, is this Vietnam for you? <laughs> so, this is my bag. Um, I got a mirror. Hey, in Vietnam, no. No, no, no. not in Vietnam. Yeah. Me? Me? What's me? Me? Uh, me? America. Monica. America. Uh, Monica. Good old USA. Ah. You know? Mm -hmm. So. Maybe I can do a quick review. <laughs> okay? <laughs> Alright. First of all, as you can see, it's a fat bike. And I went for a fat bike because a couple of reasons. One, you can go anywhere, <laughs> basically. Snow, mountains, and uh, sand, anything like that there, I can go over. There's traffic. Don't worry about. Okay, so first thing, why to go this company? Well, this company had a lifetime warranty. I, when I decided on a fat bike, they had a lifetime. Ah, okay, for me. All right, thank you. <laughs> okay, that's nice. <laughs> okay, the fact that it's me. All right. So the reason why I went for Lemire was because it had a lifetime warranty. Um, so if anything happens to the frame or any components I bought from, they will basically cover it. Uh, make a phone call if the frame cracks or anything, they will be called replace it. Um, you know, depending if it's my fault that we got hit by a car, obviously they won't, but they will give me at the dealer's price, which is pretty fair. Um, second reason, people say I went to carbon. Why I went carbon? Well, I try to figure out how and go as light as possible and most people are using steel when they're touring easy to fix it's a fact it is easy to fix you just weld it anywhere you can get it welded but with this baby as I say I can pick up a phone within three or four days uh, the bike can be the frame can be sent to me so carbon isn't really an issue and so far I've got 4,000 kilometers on this and not a problem so Let's give you a quick overview of what I'm using uh, on the components. I got a X or SRAM XX1 um, gear system. It's got 11 here, really smooth, and they guarantee the chain doesn't come off, and that is correct. Like 4,000 kilometers, the chain has never come off, it keeps its tension. Um, also, it's got a single cog. Um, pedals I'm using is 45 North. Um, these guys are designed for snow or really good grip. Um, even in flip flops, my feet don't slip. So um, the tires are by the same company, 45 North. Um, these are tubeless ones. Um, I'm actually not running tubes. I'm actually just running tubes now. Um, the wheel is carbon by the same company, Lamir. Um, the seat post, carbon. The seat. I could do with a, like a Brooks saddle, but I'm wearing padding, so I'm fine. It doesn't hurt, like maybe over about 120 kilometers, I'll start to feel it that day. Um, I have a little light on the back, which is USB chargeable. Uh, I've got some grips here, and I'm using Baryak. It's an American company um, where I attach my GoPro, and you can attach all your electronics, and also you can attach a bag below. Um, Using the iPhone for the navigation system, as you can see, I'm riding along the beach this morning. Uh, little dots. Uh, second thing is I've got my speaker. Uh, the speaker is a rugged speaker, really good waterproof. Um, I can listen to my music by Bluetooth, and also with my Apple Watch, I can control it, uh, listen to music, and also check my navigation system. Um, second thing is the brakes, is XT. Sherman, 
uh, decor really good uh, if you notice I've moved the brakes they're not right to the end they're over here all I need is one finger to touch the brakes for the really good disc brakes um, I've got a bottle cage down here which I use for putting my uh, fuel also you can see I've got an anytime cage or anything cage yet by salsa uh, people are wondering how you put that on it's pretty easy even if you don't have loops or anything you just use cable ties two cable ties and some electrical tape and the thing doesn't budge it's been on for well basically the 4,000 kilometers that I've done the trip so this is an overview of the bike I'm using uh, you see I've done over 4,000 kilometers and still good as the day about it so hope that review you didn't understand why I'm using a fat bike and also why I went carbon. Basically, I can like anything with brakes, you can with United USP or UPS, you can basically get anything sent anywhere in the world. So, uh, let's say there's my GoPro with the aluminium mount and the GoPro and what I'm using right now. So, I will get back to my coffee, my 40 cents coffee, and I've got my free kicks. So, Hope that helps. Okay. Alright, so now we're well coffee and then relax.